Greetings, everyone. There isn't anything special about this. We are just going to look at the dialogue for Perilous Expedition. It's got one day and nine hours remaining. So let's read this. Because there isn't much to it, it's just dialogue and a few chap few fights. But I'm here for the dialogue. Jeez, I'll have to trouble Lan again. But it's not like I have a choice. There's simply too much work and I'm only one person. How am I supposed to finish? I have no choice but to delay the mapping submission again. If this goes on, my living expenses here in Samaru will exceed the deposit for the commission. But, but there's nothing more terrifying than Land's Rage. Huh? What's an adventurer from Liwe doing over here? Hey, you! From the Adventurer's Guild. Huh? What's wrong? Am I not allowed to rest by the river here? No, no. Paimon's just curious. What's an adventurer from Leeway doing in Samaru? It's really rare, and you even look super anxious, so we came over to ask if we could help. I see. I'm Paiju, and you're? Paimon is Paimon, and this is Drake. So, Paiju, what are you doing here in Samaru? Ah, Paimon knows. Did you get lost? <laughs> so the cute little one is Paimon. <laughs> lost. What's so funny? It's barely funny. A three out of five. Under most circumstances, no. It wouldn't be funny. But asking a cartographer if he's lost is quite amusing. C cartographer Yes. We are responsible for surveying the landscape and updating older maps. It's one of the Adventurer Guild Adventurers Guild's duties. I am one such cartographer, but... But... I'm just an apprentice. I've completed some rough sketches, but there are tons of mistakes. I need to get... I need to get to a shaded valley or tunnel to carry out a detailed survey. Ugh, this is killing me. The terrain here is... in Samaru is so complex. And there are so many roads and caves, too. Sometimes I wonder if the entire mountain is hollow. Progress is just way too slow. I don't know the terrain as well as the locals do. Huh? Then why don't you get a local adventurer to do it? Uh, it's actually a joint project between the Samaro and Leeway branches of the Adventurers Guild, and a completed map will be provided to those who trade or venture between the two. It was entrusted to the Leeway branch because the adventurer who was supposed to be in charge had cartographic cartographic experience, and her reputation is that of absolute reliability. Supposedly, she already did something similar in Xiaoying Village, and all it took was a single glance for her to know all the terrain inside and out, and her maps were very precise too. But she left for some mining area. Ugh. Uh, did she go to ca the Chasm or Black Cliff Forge? Anyway, once we laid our once we laid eyes on her map, we all felt ashamed of our own skills. The adventurers who used her map praised it to the skies. I can't compete with that. I may have drawn a map, but there are too many omissions. And surveying everything again will take too long. I'm a stranger in a strange land. I may have the support of the Samaru's Adventurers Guild. But I'm just not efficient enough. If this goes on much longer, the deposit I received won't even be enough to cover my travel expenses. Ugh, that sounds awful. We don't really know much about cartography, though. 
Maybe Paimon can help mark where you can find delicious food on your map instead. Haha, <laughs> that's a great idea. A map showing all the best local cuisine would definitely be popular. But, well, my remaining work doesn't really require drawing the map. What's left is a final survey to verify the map's accuracy. There are a few dangerous locations surrounded by difficult terrain that I haven't been able to get to. Oh, if that's all, that doesn't sound very difficult. Yeah, maybe we can help. But most of these locations are really dangerous. There may even be monsters roaming around. That's exactly why you should leave it to us. R really With your help, it feels like it'll be done in no time. I might even make the deadline. Most importantly, supplying travelers with an updated map will help prevent them from getting led somewhere deserted or dangerous by the old map. Sounds great. Hehe. <laughs> but we'll only help you on one condition. And that is you have to mail us a copy of your food map once you're done making it. Ha ha ha. But of course. However, this map has to be verified before any of that can happen. It's all up to you now. <laughs> Oh, there are a few places to verify over here, too. All of them are hidden paths that can't be seen by just looking at the shape of the mountains. Well, Trake, is everything going smoothly? About mapping. Hmm, yes, it's tiring work. It's tiring work, but verifying and updating maps is extremely important to those who rely on them to travel and it'll help them to identify potentially dangerous areas so they can plan ahead and avoid them. As expected, the deserted areas which had to be surveyed seem to be completely occupied by various monsters and fungi. About the surveying team. Of course, there are, of course, the more people we have, the better. It's not just because places with difficult terrain are inherently dangerous, but we may even run into all sorts of strange monsters. N next time, I should ask Land to send a few more people. I'd say everything is going well. Ah, that's such a relief. But do let me know if you encounter any trouble, and I'll mark it on the map. Okay, that's it. See ya.